जय हिंद चिल्ड्रन इन अवर प्रीवियस वीडियोज यू हैव लर्न द बेसिक्स ऑफ द चैप्टर एंड ऑल्सो यू हैव लर्न हाउ टू फाइंड आउट कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री एंड सप्लीमेंट्री एंगल्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अवर फर्स्ट एक्सरसाइज ऑफ द चैप्टर विच इज फाइव पॉइंट वन सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट अवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द एक्सरसाइज इज to find the complementary angles of the following first question is here 20 degrees we have to find out the complementary angle of 20 degrees so for solution Let's suppose the complementary angle of twenty degrees is x. Now, the sum of x and 20 degrees will be 90 degrees as we have seen in our previous videos so the value of x will be 90 minus 20 this gives us 70 degrees so the complementary angle of 20 degrees is 70 degrees please note down we now we are coming to the third question Which is we have to find out the complementary angle of fifty seven degrees. In the same way, we can solve for fifty seven degrees also. Suppose the complementary angle of fifty seven degrees is an angle Z. Okay, so now we will form the equation fifty seven degrees plus Z gives us. 90 degrees. So the value of Z is 90 minus 57. So the value of Z is 32 degrees. Hope you have understood the solution of first question. Now we are moving to our second question, which is asking us to find the supplements of the following angles. is asking us to find the supplement of 105 degrees the same way we can find out the supplementary or, or angles also the way we find out the complementary angles suppose the supplementary angle of 105 degrees is x now we will form the equation on the basis of this information so x plus 105 degrees will be equal to yes you are right 180 degrees so x will be equal to 180 minus 105 so x will be equal to 70 Degrees. So the supplement of one hundred and five degree is seventy five degree, and supplement of seventy five degree is yeah one hundred and five degree. Now let's move to the next question. In our next question, we have to find out the supplement of one hundred fifty four degrees. Can you tell me that which type of angle one hundred and fifty four degrees is? Yes, this is an obtuse angle. So. What type of angle will be its supplement? Correct. Its supplement will be an acute angle. Let's find out. When we are talking about 
the supplement of any angle. Firstly, suppose that its supplementary angle is any angle z. Now we will form the equation z plus 154 degree is 180 degree. Z equals 180 minus 154. So value of Z will be 30, 60 degrees. Sorry, it will be 26 degrees. So hope you have understood how to solve the first and second question. Now we are moving to our third question. We have to find out that which of the following pair of angles are complementary and which are supplementary. complementary and supplementary we have to add them first so we solve it 65 plus 115 on adding these numbers we get 180 degrees so these are supplementary Question number three gives us two measurements 120 degrees and 68 degrees. In the same way, we will add them. It gives us the answer 180 degrees. So, these are also supplementary. Angles. SA is short form for supplementary angles. Now, our fifth question gives us two measurements 45 degrees each. We have to find out that whether these are complementary angles or whether these are supplementary angles. When we add these two angles, we get the answer 90 degrees. Since 90 degrees is the sum of complementary angles, so these are complementary angles. Now let's move to our fourth question. Fourth question is find the angle which is equal to its complement. Angle is 
k. When the angle is k, according to question, its complement should be equal to this. So its so its complement will also be the angle k. It means on adding the angle k with itself, we should get the answer 90 degrees. So k and k on adding we get 2k equals 90 degrees. k equals 90 upon 2. Since 2 is in multiplication with k, when we will send it to RHS, it will become divisible. 2 and 90 on dividing, we get 45 degrees. So the angle which is equal to its complement is 45 degrees. Now the question solve it. Now let's come to the seventh question. Seventh question is asking us, can two angles be supplementary if both of them are, if both are acute angles, if both are obtuse angles, if both are right angles. Here are three cases and we have to find out if two angles are acute, can they be supplementary? If two angles are obtuse, can they be supplementary? And if two angles are right angles, as still they can be supplementary. So we have already studied in our previous videos that for the two angles be supplementary, it is necessary that either both of them are right angles or one is acute angle and the second is obtuse angle. But here, let's assume if two ang acute angles need to be supplementary, their sum should be equal to 180 degree. Since the value of an acute angles lies between 0 degree and 90 degree. So I am taking the acute angle just short of 90 degree, 89 degree. And the second angle also, I am taking 89 degree. 89 degrees are the two acute angles and we have to add, we will add them and we will check whether these are supplementary or not. When I am adding, the answer I am getting is 178 degrees, which is less than 180 degrees. So, two acute angles cannot be supplementary angles. When we are talking about obtuse angle, the sum of two obtuse angles in the same way will always be greater than 180 degrees. Since whenever we add two obtuse angles, the sum is always greater than 180 degrees. So, two obtuse angles also cannot form supplementary angles. I will request you to check this by taking two or three obtuse angles of your choice. Now, when we are talking about right angles, the value of right angle is fixed, which is 90 degrees. And when we add two right angles, the answer we get is 180 degrees. So yes, two right angles could be supplementary angles. Hope you have understood the solution of questions. Now we will discuss more questions of this exercise in our next video. Till then, stay home, stay safe, take care. Jai Hind.